War. War never changes. My name is Ron Perlman, and I was in Hellboy. That's pretty cool, huh? <laughs> My name is Scene Anders, and this is War Inc., a free-to-play FPS game on the internet. And uh, this is from an open lobby I hosted the other day. And for all who showed up to shoot me in the face, uh, I thank you very much. I had a very good time. I'll probably do another open lobby like this, because the whole free-to-play model makes it very easy for people to jump in. And Some people have this game on Xbox or this game on PS3, but PC-based uh, free-to-play is kind of rad, because I can be like, hey, uh, in two hours, I'm going to be playing this game. You can download it. You can play. I just really like the, the ease of use and also teabagging people in the face. <laughs> That's what I do. But uh, unrelated to uh, open lobbies and completely devoid of anything you see on screen, which tends to be the case with gameplay commentaries. It's funny because they're not actually gameplay commentaries anymore. They're just commentaries featuring gameplay, <laughs> which, my bad. I think I may have had a hand in, in that whole sort of uh, way of approaching this here uh, gameplay commentary. But I was thinking about the idea of uh, maybe uh, setting up a P.O. Box. I want to know what you guys thought about a P.O. Box, because open lobbies are cool, because you can, again, interact in a way that's a little bit different than just uh, watching somebody's video. Um, a P.O. Box would be another tangible way of interacting that I think it doesn't really translate the same way as it does in a uh, digital space. So like Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. When I actually receive something, it, it bridges the gap between me just doing whatever it is I do online and the people who watch my content. And it's very, it's very important to, to have that connection. Like, for instance, the other night, um, I went super fanboy on Trey Parker. I met him at uh, a uh, Japanese barbecue restaurant randomly, and I was like, oh, my God, he's real. It's Cartman. <laughs> oh, my God. And I was super nervous. I was super, like, shy. My girlfriend's like, you got to talk to him. Like I, 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 he he made South Park. I can't I can't talk to him. And I probably embarrassed myself. I introduced myself. And I said hi. I said I appreciate what you do. Um, and it is important. It's important to um, have that connection because there are a lot of people that I respect, um, and and I want them to know that what they do is a great thing. And I think that maybe you guys see what I do and say, hey, I'd like to say hello. I'd like to connect. I'd like to be something other than just a passive viewer. Um, so I think a P.O. Box could be really cool. Like, for instance, I was thinking it might be neat to do some sort of artist showcase. I thought it would be kind of cool. There, there are probably many, many aspiring artists out there who would like to get their work seen on a, on a grander scale. And, and I've spent the last three years making this channel, and I thought, wow, this is a big platform. Maybe if there's people similar to myself, I mean, I don't really consider myself really an artist, more of a creative man of sorts where I just, I just make things. It would be cool to give people the opportunity uh, to show their work to a lot of people. And that is cool because, I mean, it is it is something that I, oh, watch this guy get crapped on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, it is cool to showcase new talent. It's, it's cool to showcase people that, that definitely deserve it. And there are so many creative people out there. Um, and I feel like they need an opportunity to showcase their voice. So, yeah, that was like a lengthy explanation. But I think a P.O. Box could be cool. Also for, let's say I ask questions, you guys can send in letters. I can maybe talk about them in a video. Um, back in the day in like a Modern Warfare 2 video, I talked about uh, this guy asked this question about whether or not I should start a YouTube channel, and I addressed that question, the person. Um, I think that would be something, I, I don't know, you, you guys tell me. I think it would be something you would dig, because just thinking about it right now, I get excited. I'm like, it would be very cool to share this space. I think YouTube is about the conversation. It's not about just showing people things. It's not like, you watch my videos in silence. We never talk or communicate on any level. But uh, let me know. Uh, if you guys say yes, I'm literally going to get in my car and drive to the post office and set this up. And uh, yeah, that's it. That's my explanation. That's my spiel. I'm going to go play some iPad games now because I have a whimsical childlike enthusiasm. But uh, thank you for watching. Thanks for uh, checking this video out. And I will see you guys later.